What's up, peeps? Back at it again. Um, pretty much just want to talk. Let's ramble about some damn titanium knives. How about that? Um, I, I like titanium. I like carbon fiber. I've found out that I do not like a full carbon fiber scale. Um, point in case being, um, all right, this Arctic storm, right? Full carbon fiber. This thing, it's, it's, I'm not saying it's a bad knife by any means. I love this knife. Um, I don't know if this might just be, I'm a picky ass wipe or what, but if I, okay, just for instance, sorry for the noise, guys, get in my drawer. Um, this sound of that, it's amazing, so much smoother, so much smoother. Sound of this, it's, it's, I don't know, it deadens the sound for me, it, it feels like it slows down the action. Um, and yeah, I could put, you know, OCD for EDC salve on there or whatever, but when I first held it, I, you know, I, I did all my adjusting and it's, you can see it's, she's smooth, man. I mean, I, hell, if it's any more drop shut, it's going to chop your damn finger off. But it's the material, right? The material. It don't sound right. I guess because the metal, it's just got that, that, ch that chunk, that thwack. Which, it, this one does too, but I don't know. It's different for me. I'm, I'm probably just OCD and stupid and it's just in my head, but it kind of ruined carbon fiber. Okay. That's not the only one though, right? I have a, a Tucson TS-262. Love the look of it. Loved it, you know? Sit there and, you know, tuned it up, cleaned it because it had, you know, just pocket grime or something in it, dirt, whatever it is. It's tuned up perfect, perfectly centered. It sounds like shit. I think it's just I don't like the sound of the carbon fiber scales. That's all it is. It deadens the sound too much for me. Um, it's an amazing knife, man. And I'm, I'm heartbroken that it turned to, it just turned to off for me. Like it, total turn off. I don't know why. It just... I don't know, man. That one's that one's a hard one. But anyways, this knife right here, dude. <laughs> this is a knife to have. Um, yeah, it's an expensive knife. Um, Best Tech, they did their shit on that one, boys. Um, this is a bade. Design Stunner, I'm butchering the hell out of that. Bade Modern Design or Bade Designs or something like that. Stunner. Um, I think the OEM on this is Kubi actually. It's got the chamfered blade, back of the blade, whatever the hell. I mean, it's it's fancy. I think it's like a $180, $200 knife. This thing is... I like the mechanic sounds of the metals. I like the... I don't know how to explain it, guys. I see, you know what? This is carbon fiber on one side, right? But it's titanium on the other, so it, it's, it gives me that, that little bit of a... I don't know, that, that sound... Y'all think y'all probably think I'm more crazy as hell watching this video, but I just don't know how to come across and how to express what I'm saying and how I feel about that. I guess the metal feel is is I'm down like that team that that solidness carbon fiber in a way, um, not knocking it, 
it's probably just as damn solid of a scale as one of these scales. You know what I'm saying? Uh, it'd be you'd play hell trying to break on one of these some bitches. I guarantee it. Um, I don't know, man. I've got this for sale uh, to help for a little bit of the blade show money. Uh, it's good knife. It's also got a damn thirty dollar lynch clip on it, but that's not what I'm talking about here. I just think personally, I'm gonna stick to a either a titanium knife or a micarta because unless the carbon fiber is like inlaid or it is like a half and half, you know, because Tucson uh, is some pretty ass carbon fiber in my opinion. But um and this one's pretty too. It's pitted. It's like a uh it's textured. I wish I could kinda let y'all see that a little better, but um there's no way to, for me to get that a little better. Maybe the shininess of the pivot or the divots or whatever I mean. But this little bitch right here smooth ass knife i've never even heard of the company um y'all probably know chaz from the wives and stuff me and him are good friends i consider him a brother um he did a crazy thing and sent me this and said hey it's yours he's a good dude man uh i kind of love it really he knows my style because I've bought knobs off of him left and right and willing and dealing trading and shit. He took the this uh all the hardware the two well not all shit, sorry guys. Not all the hardware, but the this screw, the pivot, and this screw, this screw, this he took it all well purple off. It was purple like that. I think the clip might have been purple too. Um but it started wearing off. So he's like, hell, I'm going to go ahead and just knock it all down and make it match. I like it better like that, actually. I'd like to put a damn spotty hole right there. Let's see if that sucker would work. Because you got enough to put your finger in there, and it's got enough relief. You could do it thumb or, you know, reverse. Don't need it. But that's, I mean, it's got two, three deployment options on it. Oh, shit. Three deployment options, and if you can actually hit the damn thumb stud, this one I mean, it's the same shit. Just lower roll it. You gotta, you gotta be careful with finger placement on these damn things because I'm always wanting to hit that right so you can't pull that motherfucker out like that. Sorry, guys. That will be a stone wash, acid wash blade because the guy I got it off of used it. If you can't tell, it's fine. I'm not, I'm not scared to have a used knife. I'm just gonna throw some acid wash on there and tumble it and sharpen the piss out of it. And it's gonna be pretty much my good work knife, like the other one was before I got rid of it. Um, like I said, guys, I'm pretty much just rambling at this point, like I have been this whole video. Um, what are y'all's thoughts on handle material? Um, aluminum, right? It's got that, that ding, bullshit, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's like it's just a dead sound, which is not a bad thing. I mean, it is for me, apparently, because I can't get over it for some reason. Ever since I've had the knife, I've been carrying it here and there just to to get over it, actually. Because I, I want to love this knife so bad. I want to. Because, like, look at that. I mean, hell. And I'm not one to be like, oh, it's a safe queen because the scales are nice or... I'm going to use the shit out of it if I'm going to have it and actually, you know. But this one, I'm not... I mean, you can tell it's brand damn new. 
She's a pretty thing. Won't even carry it. I mean, I'll carry this one first because the contoured scales for one. Uh, and plus, I can. It's just a plain Jane one. You know what I'm saying? Dirty as shit fingerprints. You can tell I use. But y'all have a great day. Hey.